In 1999, the kings of comedy came to Birmingham, and one of them gave Ricky Smiley the shout out of his dreams. Steve Harvey said, I got an announcement. I'm gonna have Ricky Smiley open up the show tonight for the Kings of Comedy. I'm like, you got to be freaking kidding me. 12,000 people. I went on stage and did five minutes. I put that mic back in there and I introduced Steve Harvey. And he said, stop the music. He said, let me tell y'all something. He said, this young man right here, he, he said, you can say I said it first. He said, this the next one. And I went off the stage and just cried because he didn't have to do that. He didn't have to anoint me in front of my peers. Ricky was good enough that night to earn an opening slot on several of the King's shows in 1999 and 2000. My name is there. But what put him over the top was a new character he tried out while riding in a car with Cedric, the entertainer. Hello. Hello, who is this? My name is Lundell. We was laughing so hard, man, I had to pull the car off, but we was crying. And Cedric said, Rick, you got to do that on stage. He said, if you ever do Lil' Dare on stage, it's gonna change your whole life. Y'all got some milk. <laughs> Lil' Dare was like the little special kid that everybody loves, real sweet and cute, with the big glasses, big googly glasses. Lil' Dare, you know, represents that, you know, all of us, that part that just doesn't get it. Like, sometimes you're just a little slower, you're a little behind, a dollar later, day short. And I said, my name Lil' Dare, and all you can see is this right here. And you just hear all this laughing. And so then I said, I didn't come right here to stay. All I came to say, happy Easter day. Ooh. And all I heard was people on the floor. My name Lil' Dare. Man, that was crazy. Because I went from $150 to $5,000 in two weeks. 